tonight. <laughs> Welcome ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. My name is Eddie D'Souza. And I'm Jessica Myrna. Welcome, Welcome to, to You're, You're the, the Star. star. <laughs> that was okay, in the studio today we have Sheena Bridges. Sheena, like, I, I just wanted to, to say that like, I love your voice. Thank and you. I'm, I'm really glad you got a hold of us through, through You're the Star and, and joined and decided to come in here. Couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> <laughs> so, Sheena, how long have you been singing for? Probably since I could talk. <laughs> Um, singing, row, row, row your boat. <laughs> yeah. Started out. Um, uh, then I got into just uh, singing in church, and from there it took off. Right yeah. on, yeah. And like, do you play any instruments? I attempt to, yeah, I attempt to. Um, I played the piano when I was young, and then I found that uh, practicing was taking too much of my time, <laughs> which I regret a lot because um, I, I, I did well when I was younger. Um, I have picked up a guitar. I just bought myself an electric guitar, hoping it's easier than an acoustic. <laughs> it, it is a tiny bit easier. That's yeah, good. <laughs> it's a tiny bit, though. Yeah. <laughs> but now, when I heard your music on, online, like you had some really nice video stuff, but, mm -hmm. but you did something called Band in the Box? Yeah, um, I actually found a program on the internet that um, allowed you to create um, Put in the music notes that you wanted for your song and then pick out what instruments you wanted to add to that and you could fade them out or fade them in and um then you could then you start then you downloaded that and recorded your song onto there and made a whole thing and then i have another program that allowed me to make a movie so and then put it all together kind of computer geek oh, it's, it's very well done <laughs> thanks I liked it, huh? so have you had any complications along the way with your musical career Actually, yeah. Um, it started about uh, five or six years old. I started to s lose my hearing, and mm -hmm. by eight, I was almost completely deaf. Um, had to get tubes in my ears, and it came back miraculously. And I haven't lost my hearing. So, well, <laughs> although my husband yeah. would say otherwise, well, that's, <laughs> that's good that you didn't. So we're very thankful yeah. as well. You know, um, where do you get your inspiration from? Um, <clears throat> Most of the songs that I write are just on what I'm feeling that day. Um, I guess in another sense, inspiration from my mom. She's just been so supportive, and um, and my whole family really, friends. So it just, yeah, life experience, I guess. And is anyone else in your mu family musical? Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. <on>. yeah um, <clears throat> Well, the whole one side. <laughs> yeah. Okay, right on. And, like, uh, what instruments do you play? Um, well, my mom sings and plays the guitar and plays the piano. Um, so lots of that she kind of passed down to me. And um, my dad plays the spoons. <laughs> cool, cool. Um, my sister was an amazing singer. Um, well, let's see. My brother plays the violin and the mandolin. Um, my other brother, who's sitting over there, he can play pretty much anything he picks up. He plays guitars, drums, harmonica. He just learned how to play the recorder just now. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh my goodness, uh, my stepdad, he's got an amazing ear for music and um, plays the guitar left-handed. And um, yeah, like... They're all, we get together at Christmas or something, and that's what we do. We all sit around and play an instrument. <laughs> yeah. A lot of musical talent, holy. Yeah. The spoons are cool to play, I can yeah. say. Yeah, he's pretty I, good at it. I've tried it, but I can't, I can't do it. I, I can't do it either. <laughs> so what kind of music-related events have you been involved in? Um, well, like I said, singing in church. Um, then I got, I moved to Winnipeg, actually, for a few years, and I got into a choir there that it was just like a regular course you could take for one credit, which was awesome. <laughs> mm. um, and then you could apply for uh, another credit to actually do an honor choir, but you're, there's only about 50 people accepted. Mm -hmm. We went to the BAMP National Music Festival and competed there. Um, <clears throat> I've been in tons of musicals. Um, I did uh, musical theater, so singing, dancing, acting, and won gold in the Manitoba Dance Festival with that. Oh, wow. And... Uh, came back and have just done local events, boxing matches, hockey games, 
Relay for Life on May 29th. <laughs> <laughs> well, lots of experiences yeah. in that. Like, that's great that you've done all that. Mm-hmm. No, a lot, not a lot of people can say that. Yeah. You know, at least you went out there, you've tried it. And yeah. Now you know and have all the experience from it. Yeah, it's been fun. <laughs> so I, as, you, as you create more music, do you find yourself more or less interested in seeking out and listening to new musicians? Definitely more interested. More interested. Um, yeah, I started out just listening to, you know, Mariah Carey, Whitney Houston, and just trying to be a diva. And as I grew up, I started listening more to everything. You know, of course, musical theater came in. Um, my stepdad, George, has opened me to a whole new window of music. From Led Zeppelin to, I mean, I just enjoy the music. I can't really sing Led Zeppelin. But yeah. <laughs> um, uh, all the way to uh, blues and jazz is now what I absolutely love. I love to sing it. I'm working on writing it. It's hard to write. <laughs> um, but yeah, just everything from the Seekers to Eric Clapton to like absolutely huge window of music I love. And I love mm -hmm. to hear new music because mm -hmm. it gives me, of course, I know myself a little better as I can hear those musicians. Yeah. Yeah. It kind of drives you to want to write some more songs because you see Absolutely. them making hits, so you're like, you Absolutely. know, you can, do, <laughs> you can do that. Yeah. So. And, Sheena, i got one last question for you, and that is what kind of advice would you pass on to some up-and-coming musicians? Never give up. Don't stop. Like, if you find that you have a passion at something or you have a talent, keep, keep it up. Like I said, with piano, I stopped playing, and I regret it so much now because you never know what you're going to be interested in later in life. Like, don't give up. Like, just keep pressing. No matter what anybody says, keep going for it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we're going we're gonna to watch a few of Sheena's videos right now. <laughs> 